All right, so what's up, you guys? We're back out here once again, and in this video, Jerry is working on the SR. He just tried to grab the mic from me. So I'm just gonna step away. And uh, basically in this video, as I'm staring at the SR, I'm gonna flip the camera so you guys can see, and I'll just narrate from behind the mic. Uh, okay, you guys, so let's do this. All right, so basically over here, Jerry on his SR has taken the little coolant water neck thing right here that connects to right here, his radiator hose. He took that off because basically what he's going to try and do right now Sorry, is pocket in there. he's going to try to tap so that try to put it an angle? right here so that this threads in, which this is the thread like sensor thing for the coolant gauge. Yeah, for the coolant gauge. So basically that's what he's going to be doing is tapping, tapping shit. That. He's going to tap the fuck out <laughs> of it no, and then he's going to use this to tap. I guess that, that's what you call it. What thread size is this? One eighth. Right. Oh yeah, that's true. One eighth national pipe thread. Uh, it varies for every aftermarket gauge, but I'm pretty sure it's basically a lot of stuff's that size, the one eighth. So that's what he's gonna end up doing. He's got his gauges basically sitting up in there. We were gonna make a video, like a little cool edit of him putting that in there, but he did that over the week while I was at work. So yeah. But we got a little edit for you guys coming up right here about him putting the little water neck tapping that and putting it back up seeing if the gauge actually runs and works and reads correctly and everything so yeah stay tuned you guys because we're about to i don't know we're about to do some shit bro so yeah here goes the editor right here so jerry's debating if he should tap it right there on the theme the theme, I mean the theme, <laughs> to the theme. So you go right there, go a little bit side, because yeah, uh, that will fucking split it up. Right there. He's debating because since it is a pipe thread, pipe thread yeah, gradually gets bigger the deeper it goes in. So we don't know if we want to do that. So I wanted to put crack. it right here, that way it's fucking Might crack deep. the water neck. I'll figure out where it is. All of the strains, all of the pain, moment for moment, day by day. But we can escape, but we can escape, but we can escape. And we can break the chains and run away. It's on now, it's on now. We can escape, but we can escape, we can escape.
Alright you guys, so as you see, he has his little coolant water neck tapped right there in the center of the screen. He has the sensor already screwed in and he's basically just he silicone gassed it. Oh, oh golly, I'm fucking worried up today guys. Gassed it. Yeah. He siliconed it, used a silicone gasket on it, uh, so that it seals properly. And uh, now he's about to I guess put the radiator hose back on and start filling it back up. I'm about to stick your fucking mom back on. Oh shit. Oh shit, man. Wait, does your mom watch the videos? Yeah, man, she does watch the videos. Oh. Oh, man. Hey, Josh's mommy. Alright, so what's up you guys? I'm sort of in my room right now, uh, editing the video that you guys are just watching. Um, but I forgot to make an outro for the video, so that's what I'm doing right now. But basically, we got the gauge running, uh, and working, may I don't, I don't want to say properly yet, because the gauge moves, like it indicates and everything, like what the temperature is, but it's saying that the SR temperature, like, and we let it run for like maybe 30 minutes, but it's saying the SR temperature got to like maybe 135. That's like, it, it didn't even move past 135 at all, basically. And uh, we drove it around a little bit on his driveway again and stuff to see if we can get it to go up or no fans, see if we can get it go up. And it just doesn't want to move. It wants to stay in the 140, 135-ish range. It's really weird. It wants to stay that low. Um, but we really don't know what could be causing it. If it could just be a bad gauge, bad sensor, or something like that. But... We got it in, a uh, little tap that we made for the water neck, that's, it turned out beautiful, like awesome, and everything, so, uh, but yeah, that's basically what we're dealing with now, we just don't know if the gauge is reading properly or whatnot, or if the SR is actually running that cold, um, but, I don't know, we, we don't, we don't really know, um, so, leave a comment below if you guys liked the video, uh, if you also like the video, liking helps us a lot, you guys, so please do like it up, like this video. If you didn't like it that much, just like it anyway, but if you, yeah, again, if you guys liked it, like it. If you guys want to keep watching our videos, if you like the edits that we do, um, now that I am in charge of the camera a little bit more and not working on the KA, I'm actually able to film it the way I like to film it and do my type of edits. Uh, Jerry's pretty good at filming and everything, but... I think I got a little bit more experience under my belt and I can make these edits a little bit better. So I hope you guys are enjoying it right now, like with the SR and everything, like the little edits that I'm doing. Uh, but yeah, if you guys liked it, like it. If you guys want to keep watching and be like stay up to date with us, then please do subscribe to us, guys. The little button down there, subscribe, click it. Uh, click the notification so that you know that when we post a new video, because we try and post pretty frequently throughout the week. Um, Coming up though, we might start slowing down with like how many videos are posted and everything because he's starting to get the SR to where it's running and he's sort of running out of money in his wallet. I'm sort of ran out of money with my wallet with my KA. So no parts means like less videos because we like to do parts videos and stuff like that. We're not really a vlogging channel. Like we like to vlog like this, like I'll talk to you guys and everything. But it's not like a straight vlogging channel like some of the other bigger YouTubers and stuff. Because our lives aren't really dedicated to YouTube or nothing like that. Like, we still have our jobs and school and everything like that. So, uh, we try and make it the videos as best quality we can with these edits and installs and whatnot. If we feel that you guys want to, like, 
if we should teach you something, we'll teach you guys. But other than that, we'll just make a nice little edit, throw it together for you guys. Something entertaining to watch, car related, JDMified, turboed, you know, like stuff, cool stuff that you guys can enjoy watching. But yeah, that's about it, you guys. Just wanted to let you guys know uh, what's going on basically with the channel uh, right now, currently, and for future, future wise, like near future. Um, but stay tuned to the next video, you guys, and I guess we'll see you next time. So, later.